we just got here. This is our last leg of the trip from Victoria. We spent quite a few days there with some friends and hanging out and having a good time. We swam in the ocean, went cliff jumping at Thetis Lake, stumbled across a nudist beach like at the perfect time. We went and found this crazy waterfall and we got to swim in the base of it. It was absolutely beautiful. I don't know, if you guys wanna check that kind of shit out, we could maybe start vlogging about it. Leave a comment below and see what happens. out of a shipping container. Come check it out. This is the entrance to the shipping container tiny house. It has the double French doors opening out to this view. This is the living space, the biggest part of the tiny house. Here's the couch, which folds down into a Murphy bed and it comes with TV, Netflix, all the shows, everything you want to watch. Chad and I don't have TV, so when we stay at Airbnbs, we actually love to watch TV on Netflix. We don't have Netflix. down from the wall. It's already one piece, so you just pull it down, it's already made, and then you just crawl right in. tiny houses for dining. They have two chairs included to pull up and enjoy your breakfast right by the kitchen. and tea which is always the best when you're airbnb -ing. you get a little mini fridge to keep any groceries you might have with you there's a hot plate for cooking tons of dishes actually and a toaster perfect if you want to stay a few days and make your own food Tiny bathroom, has everything you need, your shower, toilet, teeny tiny sink, comes with a hair dryer, which is super handy for people with dreadlocks. This tiny house is so interesting. It's built out of a shipping container, so it has no windows except for the French doors at the front. What do we figure, like 20 feet? Yeah. Stepped her out, it's around 20 feet. It's probably like close to, I'm guessing, like seven or eight feet. Wow. Yeah, so it's pretty tiny. This is probably, is this the tiniest one we've ever stayed in? Might be, yeah. Highly recommend it though. It's got everything you need, super cozy, hosts are great, and we really loved staying here. Yeah, it was really nice and comfortable. Until next time, subscribe to our channel, guys.
Thank you.